it's cabbage time. So get ready for the cabbage. Okay, amazing rating. <laughs> one, 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 one. That's slightly better than zero, 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 zero. Is my opponent here though? I feel like this is an ideal opponent to play the cabbage against. Is the cabbage not meant to be? Oh, I'm so sad. Opponent, come back. I just want to show my cabbage. Maybe there's an egg opening and you just haven't Ooh. discovered yet, Kappa. Yeah, I feel like there's a lot of openings that we haven't discovered yet. There's probably different types of egg openings. Like scrambled or fried or French omelette or Humpty Dumpty. Okay, uh, abort. Sorry, a macro. Let's try this again. Hey, I'm playing Dark Rug. Haha. <laughs> we played earlier. Okay, so the cabbage opening, it can start with C3 or C4. But cabbage, it starts with C. And then we play A3. So C, A. I think we know what's coming. B. Oh, I have to play this move next. <laughs> Cabbage has two Bs, right? C, A, B, B. Yeah, to play the Cabbage opening, you have to understand how to spell Cabbage. B. So far, I've played the Cab opening. C, A, B, B. A. Now I've played the Kaba opening. G. A. It's a cabbage opening. This is such a bad opening, but it's also very nutritious, full of vitamins. Unfortunately, I'm not trapping the bishop because there's bishop b4. Look at this. C, A, B, B. Oh, it's so satisfying. Okay, I'll play. Oh, let's not blunder a pawn. I was about to blunder my, my C pawn. I'll play. I'll play D3 because why not? Yeah, cabbage accomplished. Okay, bishop e2. Actually, let's play f3. Use my pawns. Pawns are like tiny cabbages. I just realized I could play the cabbage head opening. But the cabbage head would have required h and then e and then a again, which maybe wouldn't have been possible. Okay. Okay, now I'll just go for the cabbage attack. Oh yeah, I'm playing the cabbage ed f h cabbage. Wait, cabbage d f h. <laughs> yeah, I've kind of lost my ability to spell. Yeah, the pawns are slightly grinning though, which is kind of nice. I appreciate my opening choice. Okay, so I think from this point going forward, I'm going to play seriously. I'm going to try and like work with what I've done to my position and still try and find ideas. Oh, my cabbages. Or your cabbages. Okay, so now I'm actually kind of obeying opening principles of developing my knights. I brought my knight to h3 to target g5. A knight in c3 can maybe come to e4 and knights can start working together. One wants to hurt me a little bit. The knight's defended. 
crushing the bishop. Maybe going for this at some point. Also, some future idea of forking would require removing these things. Thank you, Echo. O one O one. I feel like the numbers there echo each other. <laughs> okay, we might be trading bishops. Which actually would be okay with me. Because then it could be easier to play c5. Where in the world is Eric Rose and Diego? Oh. Are you implying I'm in San Diego? Or what if I change my last name to Rosen Diego? I actually don't know what to do here. There's rook b1. Bishop g2. I'll play bishop g2. Some eventual idea of castling. I might play knight f2 first. And then go for castling. Hey, it's Irene. What's up, Irene? Irene, probably just waking up in Riga. Irene, look at what opening I played. It's a cabbage opening. C A B B A G E. It's so healthy. Uh. <laughs> Yeah, Irene is playing in the Grand Swiss. Cabbage is probably not the type of opening to play in like a serious B-Day rated tournament. Okay, the knight's attacked. Knight has one safe square. Oh, I can show off my ab. A and then B. Oh, D5 with a counterattack. Okay, so both knights are hanging. This pawn's not really pinned because my queen defends a rook. I mean, knight c5 looks nice. Hitting the queen. Now, two things are Eric, hanging. Eric, will you be in Dubai this next month? Yes. Oh, yeah, if, I guess uh, Malin Miller just joined. I was talking earlier about how... Yeah, I'll be in Dubai during the World Championship match. Um, I'll be one of the official photographers. I was showing off the, the camera earlier, too. I'll bring this to Dubai. Probably won't be bringing any cabbages to Dubai. There's probably some like agriculture rules with customs. What is this pawn structure? Quadruple pawns. Of white and black. Let's just keep winning pawns. The queen is proving to be useful. So question about the zoom on this lens. Uh, it's a 270 to 200 millimeter lens. So you can get pretty close up. From standing far away. Okay, what to do here? G4, maybe E4. Just hit the bishop. I still have all eight pawns. My queen's a little bit attacked. Play queen C7. It's weird that I just have a pawn randomly controlling C7. Okay, black wants to hurt me again. So now it's time to castle. And if takes, I take back with the F pawn, opening the F file. It's kind of sad though, that's the first pawn I've lost this whole game. But it's also kind of happy given what's about to happen. Take on G6. Okay. Oh, this is no increment and rated. <laughs> this is a rated game? 
Oh, I just realized. I just realized this queen can move along the diagonal. It's not going to help, though. Okay. Oh, the cabbage opening. Mission accomplished. I castled kind of late in this game. But again, castling, it's a very typical middle game principle. At least for me. Yeah, I guess there's a lot of potential openings. Like there's a... Uh... What else can we spell with uh, the letters A through H? Cabbage, baggage. Oh, egg. There is an egg opening. Who is talking about discovering the egg opening? The egg opening would be E3 or E4 and then G3, G4. Do I just do a whole series of like food openings? To play the dead opening, D4, E4, A4, D5. The dead head. To play the bad head opening. <laughs> oh, I feel like a, a new YouTube series is coming of just playing ridiculous openings. Ah, the dead beef opening. The egg face opening. Oh, Chad is so creative. Look at chat. The ah opening. Yeah, American Airlines can't sue us if we use more than two A's. Okay. If this goes on YouTube, let me know what opening you want to see next. Like the top upvoted YouTube comment suggesting an opening that I can spell with A through H. I will play in a future video. I feel like we've discovered a new realm of chess content. Okay. Oh, the Chad opening. Oh, that would be so Chad. <laughs> I should also mention it would have been really bad if my opponent played knight e4 here. Because if I wanted to try for a true cabbage, I would have had to move my g-pawn. And then get mated. And I don't know what I would have done. 